YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy, Booba, and welcome back to another player review on the channel. I hope you guys are having an incredible day. In today's video, man, we're going to go ahead and check out another Golasso SBC card. It's none other than Rafa Marquez. Marquez is a 90 rated card. He has medium high work rates, right footed with three star skill moves and four star weak foot. Now, we do see a bit of versatility with the card as well, which is always great to see. He can play the CDM, center back, and center mid positions. And if we go ahead and look at his in game stats in a bit more detail, boys, we can see that the card is extremely well rounded, man. 83 pace with 84 acceleration and 82 sprint speed now whether you play him in the midfield or as a center back i do think that he needs a pace boost so definitely give him maybe like the shadow or anchor now the ada shooting is a very interesting stat because he doesn't have the craziest of attacking positioning and finishing but he does have 99 shot power and 99 long shots the 82 passing for the most part is an okay stat he does have 87 short pass 91 long pass and 84 curve if you want to incorporate him in the midfield maybe go ahead and give him the catalyst the 83 dribbling is a decent stat for the card he does have really good reactions at 93 and then also 92 composure that's going to be really useful if you do want to play him as a center back the 80 agility and 80 balance isn't great but hopefully he's not that clunky on the ball the 92 defending and 91 physical are obviously the two standout stats for the card man 90 interceptions 93 defensive awareness 91 stand tackle and 93 slide tackle i think defensively man he's going to be rock solid and if we just look at his little card man i know you guys can see it he does have the anticipate play style plus as well and then last but not least boys 91 physical for the card as well 92 jumping 87 stamina 92 two strength and 91 aggression i think he's going to be a tank now if we jump on over to footbin boys we can see that rafa marquez does have eight different play styles he has the dead ball and anticipate play style plus now we all know how good the anticipate play style plus is the dead ball I mean, it's pretty useful if you like to take a lot of free kicks, if you're good at free kicks. And then he does also have the long ball pass, tiki taka, jockey, block, slide tackle, and aerial. So some pretty decent play styles. Now he can have the controlled lengthy, mostly lengthy, and controlled acceleration types. And when it comes to chem styles, boys, it's honestly going to depend on how you want to go ahead and incorporate him in game. I think if you want to incorporate him as a center back or maybe like a very defensive minded uh, center mid, I think that the shadow is probably your best option. The shadow is going to give him the mostly lengthy acceleration type. He's going to have 91 pace with 92 acceleration and 90 sprint speed. And most importantly, man, it's going to give him 98 defending, 98 interceptions, 97 defensive awareness, and then 99 stand tackle and slide tackle. With the shadow chem style, boys, he does become a 95 rated center back, which is honestly unreal. Now, if you maybe want to incorporate him in the midfield i think that the catalyst is a pretty decent option as well it's going to give him the same 91 pace and it's also going to help out with his passing because he doesn't have the craziest of passing stats but with the catalyst he is going to have 83 crossing 91 short pass and 99 long pass like i said boys it's going to come down to how you do want to go ahead and incorporate him in game what position you want him to play in as always boys if you guys do enjoy these fc24 player reviews go ahead and do me a huge favor if you guys can leave a like on today's video and also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated this is a team we're going to be using in foot champions to test out the new marquez card we're going to be playing him at the center mid position as a more defensive minded center mid in the 4-3-2-1 formation. So without further ado, boys, let's go ahead and jump into game number one and let's see how good this card really is. All right, boys, here we are jumping into game number one using the new Rafa Marquez card. And I think value wise, he's going to be very, very good. We're coming up against Salah, Diogo, Jota, Rashford, Bruno Fernandez, Clark, McAllister. It's a pretty good team. But yeah, man, we're going to go ahead and incorporate him as a center mid in the 4-3-2-1 as a more defensive minded center mid. All right, boys, first things first, let's go ahead and test out the cards dribbling now dribbling wise he doesn't have the craziest of agility and balance so his left stick dribbling might not be great and yeah man i will say he is a tad bit clunky on the ball uh he does have a bigger build as well so that definitely uh affects it a little bit but we're not here for his dribbling boys we're here for his uh defending and then also his long shots hello iron oh rafa marquez 99 long shots it's a decent attempt, man. I think as a center mid, that's going to be such a threat. Now, we did go ahead and give him the shadow chem style, so a nice little pace boost, and then his defending. His defending should be so good. Futre. We've got a little bit of space right here. We'll carry the ball forward with Marquez. There's definitely power behind his runs. The over top through ball, boys, is pretty good as well. Played across. A little bit behind. Unlucky. Rafa Marquez. We'll carry the ball forward. I like the sprint speed so far. Yeah, man. There's a little bit of power behind his runs. That's huge for a center mid. Rafa Marquez. The dribbling. I'm going to go ahead and incorporate it a little bit. He's doing a lot of AI defending. It's okay. Yeah, I will say, man, he is a little bit clunky on the ball. That's a good interception, though. I think we maybe go for, like, a long ball right here. Now, as you guys can see, man, Rafa Marquez sticks his position, man. He literally just sits in front of the defensive line. He's making that run. I tried to play it to him. Pretty sure he would have been offside. Alawiren. Rafa Marquez. Touch. Okay, man. So, going forward, I feel like you're not going to get a lot from him, but he's not that type of player. Nice, nice, nice. Gameplay is a little bit slow today. Marquez, we go over top. His long range passing for the most part has been really good so far, boys. You can definitely, definitely incorporate. I don't think he needs the catalyst because for the most part, it's been good. 
Athena, unlucky. Rafa Marquez does have the dead ball play style. Plus, I'm going to maybe try to score a goal right here. I'm not great at uh, free kicks, but we'll give it a try. I saw this on TikTok. Come on, boys. I saw this on TikTok. I saw it on TikTok, boys. Unlucky, man. Unlucky. Good attempt. Now, we do have a corner right here. I'm actually going to maybe try to get Marquez in a good position. Good pass. Still with it. Oh, yeah, boys. The strength the strength and aggression right there. Huge for the card. I need to get a little bit more defensive highlights with Marquez. That's a good tackle right there. The anticipate play style plus is huge, man. Marquez. Having that defensive cover again. That's a good touch from Rashford. But again, you always have that cover, which is huge. He's actually on the counter, man. I might actually play it to him. Over top. He hasn't covered the run, boys. Rafa Marquez. 99 shot power, 99 long shots. He's not going to miss, boys. That's a huge part to his game. Lovely goal. And if you saw in that little play right there, man, the strength is real, man. He is very strong on and off the ball. Marquez, good interception, man. Again, just holding down that central midfield. Marquez, a little bit of space right here. That Cancelo is tracking back. I could just play a pass. It's a bit of a risky pass. Boys, Rafa Marquez, man, what a ball that is. That's a great assist. I'm not going to lie, man. When I saw his passing stats, I thought his passing wasn't going to be too accurate in game. But it's a lovely through ball. Marquez, he's going to go in. Yeah, good tackle, man. Great strength. Good in the tackle. Unlucky to lose possession, though. Marquez, good interception. Power shot. Rafa Marquez! We're going to get the lucky rebound, man. But his long shots are really good. All right, boys. Here we are jumping into game number two. And so far, so good. The cost of the SPC is roughly 350,000 coins. Four requirements to complete them. And for it, you are getting a really solid player. We're coming up against Prince Shevchenko, Vinny Jr. It's an okay team. Now, I know a lot of people want to maybe see me uh, use him at the center back position. But I must say, man, I can already tell that like as a center back, he would be really good. Especially with the anticipate play style plus and his physicality. Marquez, that's good strength. Power shot on the volley. Yashin with the good save, man. The 99 long shots and shot power is very effective. Track back, track back. Marquez, lovely interception, man. Breaking up the play again. Go for an easy pass. His passing's been good, man. I did not expect this passing to be as good as it is. Oh, Alawiren, nice. Marquez, always an option, man. I will say, even with his like medium attacking work rates, he's still an option. It's a bit, it's gonna be a lucky goal if we score. It's a lucky goal. Alawiren, good one touch passing. Over the top. I don't think he's really tracked the run. Lovely ball for Marquez again. Pulling the strings. All right, boys. Here we are jumping into our final game using Rafa Marquez. In that last game, man, it just kicked us out at halftime. I don't know why. But we are coming up against the super team. Garincha Tevez and Pape Sawa de Bruyne. It's going to be a really good test. Marquez. Good interception, man. Again, just protecting that defensive line. It's what he does best. Over top. Good ball into Futre as well. He's really good at breaking up the play and then advancing the ball forward. It's like that's literally his job. All right, boys, come back. Come back season right here. Alawiren. Marquez, very advanced position. We'll take it, though. Touch. Go for the shot. Petr check. Marquez, shoot. Let's go, man. I pressed the B button like 10 times for him to shoot right there. We'll take it, man. I think going forward, he doesn't have bad either. Now, right here, man, we just whip it into him. So many people cover that in your post. Marquez should win the header. It's good, man. He's definitely a threat on corners. If you're good, definitely target him. Might try to get De Bruyne in behind. Yeah, we read that, man. Good in the tackle again. The anticipate play style plus is so good. Might try to play through. This guy's silky, man. And he does play Sawa as a left back, which is very interesting. Marquez, again, very good in the tackle. Read that, read that, read that. Now, we can carry the ball forward. I think Marquez as a ball carrier is pretty good. I think he just maybe needs a little bit more pace. Marquez, good pass. Lovely ball, man. His passing has been so good. Finesse shot near post. Booba, booba, booba. We can't be missing that, man. What a ball. Right here, man. You guys can see that Marquez is the furthest man back. So technically almost playing like a center back. Decent dribbling. Good pass. Alawiren finish. That's more like it, man. The passing is so good. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is us using the new Golasso Marquez card in a few games of foot champions. And to be completely honest, man, insane value SBC. Now, in order to complete the SBC, you are looking at around 350,000 coins. And for that price, you guys are getting a very good player with a lot of versatility. Now, if we go ahead and dissect his in-game stats in a bit more detail, we did go ahead and give him the Shadow Chem style. So 92 acceleration and 91 sprint speed. And for the most part, man, he was quite quick in-game. I will say he is in the quickest of midfielders that I ever used. But when you pair his pace, 
pace with his physicality i think going forward and then also his recovery speed is pretty good now the 88 shooting is a very interesting stat now keep in mind he is a more defensive minded midfielder but the 99 shot power and 99 long shots is really useful the 82 passing was a very surprising stat man because i didn't expect his passing to be as good as it was it is very accurate in game now the 83 dribbling i think is a good stat if you do want to go ahead and play him as a center back because the 93 reactions and 92 composure are two phenomenal stats if you incorporate him in the midfield i will say he is a tad bit clunky on the ball with his 80 agility and 80 balance and bigger build the 92 defending and 91 physical were obviously the two standout stats for the card man with the shadow 98 interceptions 99 stand tackle and 99 slide tackle defensively rock solid and then the physicality is a huge part to his game and he is very strong on and off the ball which is something that you really need for a midfielder or a defender keep in mind boys the play styles that he does have are also really important he does have the anticipate play style plus and we all know how op that is overall man i'm gonna go ahead and give the card an 8.9 out of 10 rating i really enjoyed using him as a center mid i do think that he's best suited maybe as like a center defensive mid in the 4-2-3-1 you can definitely use him as a center back if you would like and yeah man if you guys didn't know you can also go ahead and throw him into the heroic chronicles evolution you can make him a 91 rated card with even better stats if you are looking for a new defensive minded midfielder or if you are looking for a new center back i think this marquez card is great value but that is going to be the end of today's video man if you guys did enjoy it let me know by leaving a like comment down below what player you guys would like to see next and another player review and then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video i've been your boy Bulba, and i'll catch you guys in another one very very soon peace